Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Floss back again with another video and today we're going to take a look at the DJI Mavic Pro. Now this is the Fly More Combo. Now you can buy this on Amazon. I'll throw the link up in the description. The price, 1300 bucks. Now I got to keep it real with y'all. I'm not an expert on drones. This is pretty much my first one. Now, I never really been interested in flying these, but this past weekend I had an opportunity to play with a Phantom 4 and I fell in love with it. So now I'm about to become a Dronologist. All right, so let's check this out. Now, the Fly More Combo is basically a Mavic Pro with some must have accessories. So here's what you're gonna get. You're gonna get your Mavic Pro and your remote control. You're gonna get three intelligent smart batteries, your car charger, your battery charging hub. You get three sets of propellers, you get your battery to power bank adapter and a shoulder bag. Now this is gonna come in a big giant box. I just took everything out. So here we go, let's unbox this. All right. Now the reason I went with this over the Phantom 4, the size, this is way more compact. All right, so here's what you get. Here's your Mavic Pro, look how small this is. Got a nice weight on this. Xerxes can't wait to get in the box. Shout out to White Shoes. Okay, now here's your little shoulder carrying case. Nice quality material in this. Let me do a smell test. Ah, smells nice and fresh. Let's see anything else in here. Now this seems pretty heavy, so there's definitely something else under here. Okay, here we go. Now you get two more batteries. All right, so here's one smart battery. Here's the second one. And that's pretty much it. Look how Zerks. Now, like I said, this also came with some other stuff in the box. So let's see what this is. Ah. Okay, another carrying case. Portable storage bag combo. Okay, nice hard shell case. On the inside, another nice hard shell case. All right, so this is a case for your remote and a case for your drone. And of course, some poison for the trolls. Let me find that in my back pocket. Let's see what else. Now you get another little baggie. Let's open this up. Okay, got a little H on here. <laughs> Looks like a helicopter landing pad, but we'll see. What is this now? Oh, okay, look at this. This just popped open. This is actually, it, looks, <laughs> it caught me off guard. This looks like a big helicopter landing port. <laughs> this is your drone landing pad. All right, so let's get this out the way. That's a nice little touch. I didn't even expect that. Okay, this is a little piece of plastic and you get another box. So let's open this up. Now, like I said, I'm not an expert on drones, but we're gonna get into this drone life together and we all gonna grow. So if y'all got any drone tips, hit me up. Okay, here's your 64 gig micro SD card. This is gonna be, let's see, uh, landing gear. Okay, flexible, elegant landing gear. This is a micro USB 3.0 card reader. This is a camera lens, your sun hood. We'll open this up and see what it looks like. Okay, little sun hood. This is gonna be your lens wet cloth, ISO cleaning kit. Do we need to go through this? Let's just pop this open real quick. All right, a bunch of wet wipes. And this is gonna be your drone care kit. Let's see what's in here. Okay, more cleaning supplies. All right, now on to the drone. Matter of fact, let's open up this bag. This bag was pretty heavy, so there gotta got be some stuff in here. Bunch of zippers and pockets. You can put all your micro SD cards, all your cables, all your goodies. This is a quality bag too, I will say that. Little Mavic branding on the top. Yeah, I can see that. So an official accessory. Okay, so inside, let's see what this is. Now this is gonna be your extra cables for your remote control. Now I did a little research on this. Doesn't matter if you got an Android or an iPhone, you can still use the uh, remote control. Usual books and shit. Now we're not even gonna file these to the side, we're gonna actually read these. All right, let me hide this stuff from Zerts. This looks like your battery charging cable. Fall back, Zerts. <laughs> okay, let's, let's take a look at this remote control now. Here we go. Now these fold up. Let's see, uh, these fold down, and here's your remote control. All right, so we'll get into all of this in a minute. 
This is some straps for your bag. Here's all your charging cables. Car charger. Four bags, Zerks. Let's see, uh, your charging plug. This is a uh, micro USB to USB A charging cable. This looks like your battery. Let's see. We'll figure this out. <laughs> we'll figure this stuff out. But that's pretty much it. Now, let's take a look at the drone itself. Lightweight. This, uh, these two legs unfold out. The bottom two, let's see. And these fold down. Okay, so here's your drone. Now, we're going to slap on these extra propellers. Comes with one battery already pre-installed. Hold up. Let me file Xerxes to the side. Rah. <laughs> she landed in the box. Don't worry. All right, so here's your other battery. Now, here's your drone. So what I'm going to do is I'll pause the video. I'll read up all the books. I'll let all the battery charge. We'll calibrate the drone up, and we'll take it outside for the maiden voyage. Now, in the front, this is your lens cover. Okay, now you got a, a gimbal cover also. Let's see. Let's let's see if we can get this off without breaking it. Hold up. Oh. <laughs> All right, the lens cover popped off. There's your gimbal on the front. All right, so like I said, let's charge up everything. We'll calibrate it, and we'll go get some footage. Now, it's a cloudy day outside, so we'll try to make the best of it. Talk amongst yourselves. All right, y'all, so we back in. Now, I just downloaded the app. I did all the updates. I charged the battery, the remote control. I calibrated all the sensors, so I'm ready to go. Question, did I read the book? And the answer is no. Now, let me give you some free advice. You just spent $1,300 for this whole setup. Read the book. Now, if you like me and you ain't got time to read the book, you just got your drone in the mail today and you're ready to fly today, let me show you a couple of YouTube videos that's gonna really help you out. Go to Flight Path. All right, I'll leave the link up in the description. Watch this video first. This is gonna show you your initial setup, everything that you gotta do before you even go outside. Then you're gonna watch the next video from Flight Path, 12 tips, your first flight. That video is gonna show you everything that you gotta do once you get outside. Now, I've been studying these videos. I watched 101 drone videos, but these two I found are the most helpful, and they're not using all that technical mumbo jumbo, all of that drone language that us noobs don't know yet. This one is nice and simple and easy to follow. So with that being said, I'm going to take these outside for my maiden flight. Now keep in mind, like I said, I'm not a drone expert, so I'm not playing with none of the camera settings. Everything is fresh out of the box. So let's check out some video quality. Take off. The whole point has been updated. Please check it on the map. Here we go.
Alright, so I just came back from my first flight using the Mavic Pro, and I gotta be 100% honest with y'all. My heart is still pumping, I'm still smiling. This is the most fun I have with a tech product in years. Now the last time I had this much fun with a gadget is when I first got my Google glasses and I was walking around feeling like James Bond. This is right up there with that. This is 100% a major, 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 major go. This is definitely gonna be my new hobby. I'm loving this. I'm already looking at the Mavic Platinum. This is way too much fun. Now as usual, there's some things that I don't like, so we'll talk about those real quick. Number one, the battery life on the controller isn't that great, and the problem with that is you can't charge it and use it at the same time. Now you can fly the drone using just the phone if you want, but the real fun is using the joystick, so you can't charge it and use it at the same time. That's kind of a downer, especially if you got two extra batteries. That's not gonna help you if your uh, remote control is dead. My advice, Get yourself a portable battery charger, and when you're taking your little breaks, charge up the remote. Now, the next thing I didn't like was the calibrations. Now, it's pretty tricky calibrating them, especially if you live in a city. It's hard to find a spot where there's no magnetic field, so I had to go all the way into the middle of the park in the grassy field to get it calibrated. So I can see that being a problem if I'm trying to make a video somewhere in the back streets or in the city. Maybe there's a workaround for that. I gotta do a little bit more research. Like I said, I'm a rookie at this, so we'll figure that out. Now, on a side note, when you watch the video, keep in mind, this is my first flight. So I gotta realize that when I'm panning right to left, I gotta do it slow. I was going kind of fast, so y'all see the video jerking a little bit. Cut me some slack. This is my first flight. My next video is gonna look way better. Now, one more thing I gotta mention. A lot of times when I make videos and I say I like something, I get the same comment all the time. Oh, you're only saying you like it because the company sent it to you. You're only saying you like it because you're getting paid to say that. I hate doing shit like this, but look, I bought this myself. This is not a sponsored video. Nobody paid me. Take it from me. If you buy one of these for 1300 bucks, you're gonna be satisfied. Now, one thing I forgot to mention also, when you buy the accessory pack, you get a bunch of extra propellers. That's gonna come in handy because at some point you might end up crashing and then you're gonna have to wait to get new propellers. So buy the accessory pack, you get some extra propellers and you can charge up all your batteries at the same time. That's a nice little feature. Oh, and this landing pad, it looks so boss when I was out in the park. Y'all seen in the video? This is so crazy. Oh, let me tell y'all this too. One thing I'm gonna tell y'all, now I'm a rookie at this, but when you're flying your drone, I had it set on beginner mode. So beginner mode means that it's only gonna go to a certain altitude and it's only gonna go to a certain distance. Fine, now even though it says beginner mode, this thing goes up so high and so far, if you take your eyes off of it for one second, you won't even see it. Now I'm busy looking at the drone, I looked at some birds, I turned back around, the drone was gone. Completely gone, I was nervous and excited at the same time. I was having so much fun. But when you press that button, return to home, all I did was just sit there. I couldn't even see the drone. I just sat there and then before I know it, I heard the sound, the, the sound of the propellers. I looked up, the drone was right over my head. And y'all watch the video for yourself. It landed directly on the landing pad. So the software on this, it's crazy, don't worry about losing the drone. Even when my remote control battery was about to die, it told me in 10 seconds, it was automatically gonna bring the drone back. So I'm definitely feeling the software, I'm feeling this whole setup, I'm impressed. Anyway, I'm gonna get back heavy into the drone game now. I got two other drones, some cheap ones, that I never opened, I had them sitting in the house for months, I didn't realize it was gonna be this much fun, so I'll start reviewing a bunch of drones, and like I said, we got the Mavic Platinum, we getting that on day one. This is insane. Hit me up in the comments. Let me know what y'all think about this. Shout out to everybody rocking with me on Facebook, Foursquare, Twitter, Google Plus. Shout out to all the Google gangsters. I see y'all holding down that Facebook page. Shout out to everybody hitting me up on Voxer. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with me on Instagram. Y'all know that's where I'm at full time. 100% full throttle. And a special shout out to everybody rocking with the new stream on Sundays. Y'all already know. Stream gangsters on deck. Get your drinks ready. No meat boys allowed. Oh yeah. Special shout out to everybody following me on Snapchat. Flossy underscore Carter. That's where I'm at. And a special shout out to the notification squad. 
I'll see y'all in the comment section early. Hashtag salute. Oh yeah, one more thing. I almost forgot. Fellas, ladies, say it with me. All y'all haters, all y'all trolls, close your eyes and picture me rolling. It's your boy Floss, I'm out. Deuces. Spock won the beam up. Primitive captain, Enterprise out. Energize. <laughs>